Welcome back to the Sunday Business Page. If a man or a woman's home is the family's castle, protecting it from a break in or other emergency is essential to happiness and security. Over the years, methods to improve security have evolved along with technology. So, how does Guardian Protection Services, a company with Pittsburgh area roots and about to mark its 70th birthday next year, keep up with the times? Recently, Guardian underwent a rebranding of its product and a refocus in its business strategy. We're so pleased to welcome Brian Cipolletti, Guardian Protection Services president of the Sunday Business Page, to share his thoughts with us. Brian, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me, John. Happy anniversary, 70th next year. It's exciting. Year. It, it really is exciting. Is. And roots here in Pittsburgh. So tell me a little bit about Guardian Protection Services. We see your signs everywhere. Yeah, well, you're going to be seeing more of us here pretty soon. Um, yeah, we do have roots in Pittsburgh. We started in Pittsburgh really 70, almost 70 years ago. Um, but things have really taken hold in the last 20 or 25 years. We have uh, 300,000 customers across the country and 14 branch locations. You're across the country. We're across the country. We're in, I think I counted eight or nine states where we have core, what we call core markets. Right. Um, and we have, like I say, 300,000 customers, but 40,000 of those are in Western Pennsylvania. We've been in Pittsburgh longer than anywhere else. Okay. And Pittsburgh is the home to our headquarters one of our two central monitoring stations and our Pittsburgh branch operations. Well, we're glad that you're here, and I want to ask you about the changing technology in this business because I see the ads, you know, yeah. about using your cell phone or, uh, or your door yeah. bell ringers and all this kind of stuff. So what's going on in the protection services business, and how does Guardian compete? Yeah, well, the, the technology continues to evolve and advance, and there are more and more players trying to get into this space. Um, and they get in in pieces and parts. Uh, you mentioned there are some um, do-it-yourself players in the market. There are some niche players who just provide a certain product or a service like a doorbell or like a um, thermostat. Uh, but Guardian, we have and continue to be committed to providing safety as well as you know, smart home security uh, and connection for our customers. So, so what does that mean? What is the basic safety. service that you provide? So the basic services we have, we provide professionally installed, professionally monitored, 24 by 7 with two award-winning central monitoring stations um, who um, continue to monitor um, the security services in your house. And first and foremost, we're all about safety, intrusion protection, fire protection. Is this in terms of cameras that are watching no, what's it, going it's on? Heat, or is it's heat detectors, smoke detectors, uh, motion detectors, um, door and window contacts to notice if anybody intruding on your home and immediately our central station is alerting and there's a call to you and or the authorities if needed. All those other newer technology features and functionality, whether they're video doorbells, lights, locks, thermostat, things like that, cameras, internal, external cameras, are all part of um, add-on features and functionality to the core home security service that we offer. But we try to stay um, true to our, our core, providing security first and all those other features as, a, as additional components to the service and make it easy for you to manage and utilize all those features. So you could get those other features with Guardian. You absolutely can. But your basic package, what you offer, is something more than the little gimmicks that in it, gadgetry we It see. really is. We're, we're, once again, it's core protection, but in addition to that, all of those gadgets and features and functionality that uh, different people may desire. So what is this rebrand all about? Yeah. How are you rebranding uh, protection services? <laughs> I mean, you already are in it. What yeah. Is well, you know, we've been in business, as you said, uh, about 70 years, um, and technology has evolved, right? The competition has evolved. And inside our company, we have relatively new leadership, mm -hmm. um, and the leadership has evolved, uh, evolved. And there's a new focus on customer interaction. There's a new focus on streamlining mm -hmm. our process and procedures, making it easier for customers to know how to use and interact with their security service. Um, so what we've done is kind of taken this opportunity to modernize kind of our look and feel. Right. It's not like another, it's like coming out party what for you us. You mean like again. new logo? Like it's going to be new logo and you're going to start seeing, like you say, you've seen us a lot because we have yard signs for yes. 70 years around. But now, uh, 
especially in western Pennsylvania, you'll start to notice we have a partnership with the Pittsburgh Steelers. Mm -hmm. If you've been to a pirate game, you'll notice we're the official security company of the Pittsburgh Pirates. And if you look out at left field where the pirate bullpen is, you'll notice it's all purple with Guardian logos there. We do a lot of things in the community. We are well, one of the sponsors of the Pittsburgh Marathon. Right. Um, so you'll see us more visible in the community, visible in terms of um, trying to promote our brand so that people know who we are. We're not that sleepy little security company that's been here for 70 years. We're out front so that if you decide you ever want to have the kind of protection that we offer, hopefully you think to call us. Well, I think having those little signs is great. It I is mean, great. you ought to tell people that, hey, you step onto this property, you run a certain risk yeah. if, you're, if you're up to no good. There's value in that. There really right. is. You're not getting rid of those. Actually, but we're going to be we're going to have some new ones. So if we're going to have the, the new look, the new logo, we'll be replacing all those old signs. Yeah, yeah, good. It's exciting. So has the crime that we see in either the Pittsburgh area or around the country, has it changed over the years and maybe become technologically more sophisticated in terms of defeating some of the some of the products that you offer? Yeah. Boy, I don't, John, I don't have statistics on crime, but I know that people more and more so um, are so active and involved that they could use the extra comfort, the peace of mind of, of knowing that their home, their valuables are protected, whether the crime is growing, you know, or declining. Right. Well, I guess the question was whether the technology has to change in order to meet the modern day criminal. Uh, yeah, well, um, I tell you, there's just a lot of, of basic intrusion detection things that continue to survive today. Now, the things have evolved in terms of more wireless features and functionality so we can do more things than we've done before. So, yeah, we continue to be more sophisticated in our security offerings. Well, Brian Cipolletti, thank you so much for sharing with us, and good luck to you as you rebrand the company. Happy anniversary. Thank Keep you, Keep us all safe. We all right. really appreciate that.